you hear it? It's like some cat heat or something, or a cat fight. Sounds awful. <laughs> so what happens when you're out in the country? All kinds of weird nature noises. Why are you dying, computer? Is it because you were $260? Is it because you were cheap? Is that why? Huh? Male celebrities have done way worse things than you. Think about how they're treated in the media versus- I love this girl. No, no, no. Just Latasha. She's awesome. She's so much better than I will ever be. stuff and like emitting FM noise and doing some really weird stuff so I think it's the combination of the M audio and the fact that the sound card on the computer is also a little bit fucked. <sighs> Musicianing while poor. It's not great. <laughs> Voices in my head playing like an echo, echo, bang 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 on the wall. From dusk till dawn. Mm. It happened again. <laughs> I am having the hardest time picking out a base. It's really annoying. I've gone through a bunch of stuff in Native Instruments, a bunch of Ableton's instruments. I'm not. <sighs> I'm not finding it. There's a particular sound that sometimes you're looking for and you're like, where is that sound? Ugh, and I even have the bass line already mapped out and everything, I know exactly what it should sound like. I just need to find something that mixes well with the other instruments. It's really irritating. Third time's a charm, right? Is that how it goes? So I'm definitely sure now it's something to do with the wire anytime the wire gets displaced and the um, M audio gets disconnected from the sound card, Ableton throws the system into a panic or something and then it shuts down, which is you know, annoying, but I got some good work done for a second and the next thing is I'm going to try to figure out the melody, try to sing something, on top of it, try to figure out a chorus, it's a lot of work ahead. And I really hope this computer doesn't turn on and off because it's gonna make the work even harder, even slower. So my process is always to try to have a lot of activity going on around a central motif that beds the song and like kinds of provides a stability in the same way that you might have a Oh my god. I keep on birdie burping and spit spitting and spilling and Show my flawed humanity in a lot of ways in these vlogs. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I also keep on apologizing too. So I'm not sorry. Less sorry. Um, 
But yeah, anyway. Um, yeah, that's kind of like my method for any song. Like if I find there are too many elements bouncing around, I always like to bet it. Like, you know, you have a kite flowing, floating off, but you have somebody holding you onto it, and that's my synth. So the next choice to make after like finding some kind of random beat and an interesting melodic thing in the middle is to find a synth that's gonna bet it to go along with the bass that I've had to like spend 10 minutes choosing. So that's the next step. But these days I like piano sounds a lot, so I'm gonna also add like a tinkling piano going along with it. When I did some like chanting sounding thing, it was really fun. <laughs> Progress slowly but surely. Another thing that happens with my songs is that sometimes I just get super lazy in the middle of them and then I just like, I try to make the laziness artistic and say, yeah, I know the song is saying all it needs to say, I don't need to stretch it out. Sometimes I always want to know like, if a song is actually complete or if I'm just like, eh, can't bother. <laughs> I think most of the times I do think that short songs can pack a good punch and I like them. Like, um, some of my favorite songs, like um, Crown Royal by Jill Scott, that song is short but amazing. And another one is that um, Franz Ferdinand, I was obsessed with them when I was a kid, oh, obsessed when I was a tween, like crazy, crazy obsessed. And the thing is that their album, their debut album was actually pretty short. And the songs were all super sweet and short and just punchy and they weren't boring, they didn't go on forever, you can get tired of them because they were just like, it. So I like short songs, I like songs that just get to the point, but at the same time I'm wondering if, if it's my lazy nature that makes me have an affinity for short songs. <laughs> Who knows? Uh... song and put the song on the vlog again but yeah it's just not happening it's so hot in this house it's so weird it never used to be this hot in the house or this side of the island dare I say it global warming global warming stop it it's so hot do 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 bang 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 on the wall from dust till dawn ah chung 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 I kind of want to do a new disco type of song as well. I have one actually. I decide who is gonna be in my mind. Wait. into a two-part song or something and I don't really like the second half but I do know one of the theses that I'm trying to go with and the place where I eventually want to take it I keep on seeing these Twitter quotes about um, between text and praxis I remember I forget who the quote is from but I'm gonna look it up and read deep, more deeply into it to understand what the message actually is, but I think it has to do with um, decolonization and, you know, how it's, um, you know, you have to take a, a mandate and it'll make a lifestyle change if you really want true equality for you and yours and that kind of thing, so it's pretty cool um, and I feel like I want the song to end up there, 
But in the meantime, I'm going to get you guys to listen to what I've done so far. It's not polished at all. I know it still needs work. But I also think it's interesting to just document the growth of a song and how it comes to be something. So right now it's like about a minute and 20 seconds long. And I'll see what happens next with it. I, I just, I like it so far. I think it's got a cool energy to it. And I kind of wanted to kind of like filter into something a little bit more slow meditative and interesting and I have some cool scratchings that I really want to incorporate so we'll see what happens but yeah that's it for today slash yesterday so next time I wake up because it's 6 a.m. 6 30 in the morning so next time I wake up around the afternoon the evening I'll make another one of these I guess or maybe I'll just stay up all day I make the vlog and then go to sleep like in the afternoon. Yeah. And then I have another writing assignment coming up soon. Another story to write. So I'm going to get that done right quick and get some moolah. All right. Hope you guys are well and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. i